So the difference between boiling and evaporation, sometimes they ask you for those. So boiling is happens throughout the liquid. This happens at the surface only, okay? And uh, evaporation, again, because evaporation only happens at the surface, there's no bubbles. Because bubbles are when there's a gas particle surrounded by liquid. So if it's only happening at the surface, there's no, no bubbles. So this does have a bubble. And this is a fast process because all of them are gaining energy fast. This is a slow process. Okay. And boiling is when there is no change in temperature because all of them are increasing their kinetic energy. So the average is constant. All of them are overcoming the forces. Okay. All energy is used to do that. But evaporation has a temperature lowers down. So temperature decreases. And if boiling happens at fixed temperature, fixed temperature for pure substances, but it happens at all temperatures below boiling point. Of course, at the boiling point, evaporation stops because now everything is boiling up, temperature is fixed, so it's not decreasing, and that's happening. So do you understand this? The key ideas here are, one, how does temperature change? Two, how does state change? And why does temperature not change when state changes? It has everything to do with this thing. That energy, if it goes into kinetic energy, temperature will change. If it does not, and it's used to overcome the forces, temperature will not change. Only the state will change.